What I'm thinking about titling this video is probably kind of clickbaity, but it's a little story time, folks. Also, I'm in a really awkward setup, so here's the tea, sisters. Um, just kidding. I don't. Anyway, I've been getting so many comments. Guys, you need to stop commenting on my my videos and my photos and DMing me on all my socials because like it's seriously crazy and it's just blowing up my phone. No, I that that was sarcasm, folks. Um, literally nobody's requested this video. Literally nobody's requested any video ever from me. <laughs> but I'm doing it anyway. So if you do follow me on Instagram, you would know. Which also <laughs> plug, but you would know that I moved across the country. I know, you can really tell that I'm not in Iowa anymore based on my surroundings. But regardless, I am from Iowa and I go to school in Iowa, I've grown up in Iowa, and now I moved all the way to Arizona. Kind of random and let me tell you what. So there's this program through my school, Iowa State University is where I go to school. Um, called National Student Exchange and it's pretty much exactly what it sounds like it's like students um, from certain universities around the United States can choose other universities who are also part of the National Student Exchange short NSE so um, Iowa State's part of NSE and Northern Arizona University is part of NSE anyway so um, that's why I'm here at Northern Arizona University now I'll tell you a little bit why we chose here, kind of. So basically, my friend Becca and I are here together. And we knew we wanted to like do something fun, adventurous, do the NSC thing. Um, it originally started as like a couple people, a couple people from our friend group sort of were like, oh, we should go to Hawaii next year because Hawaii is an option um, to go to. And um, then, you know, that just got us thinking about it, um, decided not to go to Hawaii. That was mainly because, for me, like, a plane ticket is an investment. And, like, that adds a lot onto the cost of something when I'm trying to not spend money. So, we knew we wanted to go somewhere, like, on one of the coasts. <laughs> Our window's open and I'm like, eh, eh, eh. But anyway, we knew we wanted to go somewhere on, like, either the coast because being from Iowa we wanted you know something different so we were like California am I right hashtag Cali baby hashtag LA you know as a vlogger I was like I belong in LA <laughs> just kidding but yeah we were like looking at California there's a couple schools in California we were looking at Northridge I think maybe it's not Northridge no it's not Monterey Bay question mark I don't know anyway it was near San Francisco and so we were like dope we're gonna go to San Fran like neither of us have been there and I'm um, sorry I'm like looking out the window because I'm <laughs> insecure don't know before we're going to San Fran baby no Cal no Cal no Cal am I right isn't that Northern California no Cal no Cal no Cal surfer ready ready for some you know chill vibes California and then we like met with our advisor about it and they were like yeah this school doesn't offer like on-campus housing because it's like in a city so you just have to like get an apartment in San Francisco and we were like skirt skirt what no thanks um San Francisco, I'm pretty sure, might be the most expensive place to live in the United States. So we walked out of that meeting like, frick, what should we do? Like, we really kind of like had really been thinking about California really seriously. But that was the case with a lot of California schools. So we were like, hmm, this is, this is as they say, a pickle. Pull up the list of schools that were offered. And we were just both kind of like perusing the list. And just randomly, we we're both like, what about this Arizona school? Hmm, this is a coincidence. Like, we both just happened to be looking at this. And so, long story short, we chose Northern Arizona University in Flagstaff. Go Jacks. 
I don't know how that is. I've only been here for a week. That's kind of how we chose Arizona. And it's just funny because, like, we chose it and we were like, okay, like, we'll do it. And just kind of dope de dope de do Because this was, like, um, I don't know, nine months ago. It was a while ago. And so the prospect of it seemed so far away. So we're like, dope, going to Arizona next spring. Okay, on to freaking whatever I'm doing right now. So it just was in the back of my mind and I'm like, you know, going on with my life over the summer. And then when the school year started, I started thinking about it more because I had to like, you know, pick out classes and blah, 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 rooming, housing. Um, <gasps> oh my gosh, I just like stroked my hair and it like made like a sound. It literally sounded like a freaking bug. Okay, so funny. It's just so quirky, you know? So. There's my train of thought. Where, where is it? What was I talking about? Arizona, Arizona, Arizona. Oh, so anyway, started thinking about it more. And then I was kind of like, what the frick, Annie? Like, Arizona? There's a lot of places that I want to live you know, or like travel to. Like I California. I love Oregon. I love Washington. I mean, I love Wisconsin, but that's not where I live. But New York. Um, I really like northern states because I kind of like the cold. I was like, never in my life have I ever like thought about Arizona as a place that I wanted to go, let alone like live. Which not like nothing against Arizona, but it's just like. I just hadn't had a lot of exposure to it. I don't know, you know, just like, it's just one of those states, probably how most people think about Iowa. Oh, yeah, like, Arizona. Cool, dope, whatever. You see, Arizona is cooler than I. Well, to the naked eye, of course, not to the soul. I was like, what is happening here? I'm going to Arizona, not like Flagstaff, Arizona. What even is that? And um, I just was kind of like, pretty much for the month of October, pretty bad anxiety about it not like I don't want to like offend anyone I didn't really have clinical anxiety but just I was anxious about it I was literally just super anxious super on edge just like nervous like I don't know and that was a time of the year where I had to pick out classes we had to get rooms you know and like start paying for stuff and I was like what is going on and so I was kind of like I don't want to say dreading it because I chose to do this you know it's not like I wasn't excited but I was like also having a really great semester at Iowa State like just really better than I ever could have asked and I was like why am I leaving this situation you know and I was just kind of like I don't know it just was confusing to me like in my brain here I am at Iowa State pretty close to my family have all these friends like have awesome roommates why am I just leaving this and you know I'm I like to think of myself as an adventurous person however the follow-through on the adventure I learned that through this I like the idea of adventure I think more than the actual thing and the word adventure is just kind of what does that even mean but you know I've always been like I want to live here I want to go here I want to travel here and I've never really done it before. I've never really sent it, as you say. But this time, you know, I just thought, yeah, heck yeah. Why wouldn't I? And, you know, sent it. And kind of was really nervous about it. I wasn't just like, oh, whatever, yeah, I'll just pack some stuff and live in Arizona for a semester. No big cheese. Yeah, big cheese, people. Big freaking cheese for me. It really had to be like, spirit lead me. spirit lead me. I love hate relationship with comfort zones because I'm like I love comfort. I'm like who the frick doesn't honestly even if you're really crazy. Comfort's nice and I really like comfort and I was super getting comfortable in Ames but I'm also like you know I stopped recording for a hot sec but I think we're good. You know I'm gonna be in this uncomfortable position but this is my plan. This is where I'm meant to be at this moment. And so, um, yeah, I guess the point of this video is to tell you like why I'm here. Um, part of it is because I just literally just chose to be. It's kind of like study abroad, like, but 
I also am just excited to see what is in store here. And as I'm filming this right now, we're, we're like on our third day of class for the semester and we've been here for a week. So it's still new, but I'm already feeling a little bit more like adjusted than I was like three days ago. But I will say that like every single day I miss my family so much and I miss my friends a ton. Oh my gosh, I miss my family literally so much. I know that that is like a good thing because that means I love them a lot and I like spending time with them. But I'm also like, okay, I really need to live in this moment. And so I think another point of me filming this video, I guess I'm just making up now, is like sort of be held accountable, like, or just speaking it into existence. Like I really am trying, like some of my goals for this experience are to A, live in the moment, I guess, you know, just live in this present experience. Here I am in Arizona. Be appreciative that I am able to do something like this. And secondly, I need to uh, not compare. Um, it's been really hard for me since we got here. I feel like every single time I talk to someone, I'll be like, so what clubs are you in here? And they're like, oh, I'm like, well, like talking club. And I'm like, oh, well, and I would say there's this club like or like something for me that has been just very hard is comparing my youth group and like my the ministry I was in at Iowa State was called the Salt Company and I'm like I really love the organization and I really love the people and I'm you know pretty active in it and so that was like a huge thing at school for me that was like a lot of the people I knew a lot of the things that I did were involved with that so coming here, I really wanted to find, or I really still want to find, I'm going to a couple places, but um, a ministry, but um, I cannot compare those. I can't. I can't compare anything. This isn't Iowa State. These aren't my friends. These aren't my family. Like, I'm making new friends and, you know, joining new youth groups, joining new clubs, having new classes, eating at new places, and yeah, it's not the same. So I really am just like, urging myself to get rid of the thought of comparison it's really hard now because right now I'm still I don't know anything here well I'm still really learning the basics of like how it works and so yeah I'm like oh well, this is how it is at Iowa State so I'm confused <laughs> like um yeah but anyway I kind of wanted to make this video um this is mostly for me not to be hashtag selfish but like right now let me just give a quick synopsis i've been uh, scared anxious nervous a lot a lot of nerves a lot of nerves and just like <laughs> uncomfortable like where do i go like where do i sit how does this work do i use my dining dollars like do i can i use my jacks card for this how do i take the bus I just don't want to like give the illusion that I'm like adventure girl. No, I'm like I I I for a while I think I couldn't even like comprehend it because I'm like what the frick am I doing? And you know now that I'm here, it was really hard at first to adjust, but um, it's getting better now that classes are starting. But anyway, I just don't want to like give the illusion that I am like this crazy fun travel girl. Like, I love to travel, but this is different for me, and this has been very nerve-wracking, very scary for me, and um, scary in a safe way, like, I'm at a college campus, I have resources, I'm still in America, I just wanted to say that, like, I just wanted to let my future self know this is how I'm feeling right now, <laughs> what's up, Annie, and also just wanted to let the world know that, like, I'm just being authentic you know, authentically any, no big deal. Because some people are like, oh, that's so cool. And I'm like, oh, I'm so nervous. And why am I doing this? So I don't know. This was a video of me rambling on and on and on and on. Sorry. If you watched all the way to here. Wow. Here, I'll, I'll sing you a song. You are a loyal subscriber. You are loyal subscribe thanks yeah I, I'm so bad at like wrapping things up I feel like I've been trying to wrap this up I was like this is gonna be like a 
a 40 second video just to, like let them know and now I'm like Wah! but so thanks for watching if you watched the whole thing and yeah I really want to try to document a lot of my experiences while I'm here because it's new and different so I'm gonna try but I really can't promise anything that's why I'm in Arizona sorry if this was a really clickbaity title I'm just trying to get views like and subscribe or whatever um bye